Measuring surface area and porosity of powders is difficult. There are few techniques available, but none of those are straightforward. The choice for surface area measurement generally comes down to a technique known as BET. The measurement of porosity and surface area by BET is a relatively simple measurement to carry out. Let's have a look at how BET works. This is the sample of the removal of moisture and other contaminants that can interfere the analysis. After preparation, the sample is evacuated, then cooled to cryogenic temperature, which is the temperature of liquid nitrogen. The actual measurement of gas sorption begins by exposing the sample to a low pressure of adsorptive gas. As the pressure of gas rises, so does the amount of the gas adsorbed at the surface until a monolayer is formed. Also observe the isotherm curve as the monolayer form. It will be used to calculate the BT surface area. Additional molecules are then adsorbed as the sorption process moves through multilayer formation. As the pressure of gas is further increased, we see the beginning of mesophore filling, often referred to as capillary condensation. Note the rise in the isotherm. Small pores will fill up before the larger pores. If the pores are too large, they can be filled completely, denoted by the approach to a plateau value that completes the adsorption branch of the isotherm.